what we do at the Institute is really for that generation, the next generation. And the fact that uh, we can uh, be engaged here in Venice is um, frankly a gift uh, to our mission. And um, um, what I want to do is thank everyone that has helped us uh, to this point here in Venice. We have, as the video uh, mentioned, we have two centers on purpose, one in the West, in Los Angeles, the other one uh, in uh, Beijing, in China. And um, we felt that Europe, um, these days especially, could almost play the role of a neutral uh, laboratory um, for ideas, for rethinking democracy, rethinking capitalism, work on uh, geopolitical issues and on the impact of technologies on our lives. And Venice seemed like the least obvious idea and maybe the most obvious idea in the sense that Venice, at least in my mind, is like a meta city. It's beyond its history, which is extraordinary in all the fields that I mentioned, everything from um, an incredible political system and experience, uh, an extraordinary trading center and a center of innovation and of technology. Uh, Venice is really a meta city in the sense that it attracts people, attracts minds from all around the world, way beyond its location, way beyond Italy, way beyond Europe. It really is a place that has historically brought Invention, thinkers, courage. Today it, bring, it has art, architecture. It's really a place for ideas to be exhibited and shared. What my dream would be is can Venice become again a creator of ideas? A place where ideas are helped not just to be exposed but shared and maybe even developed. Venice has the advantage of having a number of different civic institutions, uh, very important programs, obviously the Biennale, uh, the Fondazione Venezia, uh, headed by Michele Bugliesi, but also Ca Foscari, uh, the university, which has more than 20,000 young people as students. And to me, students uh, in a university are maybe part of the answer. I just want to say that I'm so grateful uh, that we can engage the Institute uh, here in Venice and I appreciate uh, the partnerships that uh, we are just beginning to forge uh, in this very, very special city. I also should thank um, uh, one of our board members, Eric Schmidt, uh, for being here. Uh, he's been a great ally with us. Uh, over the years and um, he symbolizes also the kind of um, ambition and bent on learning about what changes the world, meaning technology uh, that we engage with. Um, I also should say that I'm very grateful that my brother Olivier is here because he and I have been coming to the Drudeca to place actually a few feet from here since we were probably He's younger than these two that are sitting with me here. So we have a very special attachment um, to um, Venice. So again, uh, from a personal standpoint, I'm uh, extremely grateful.